All right, so I wanted to do a video on setting up the K100 truck and trailer mod. Um, we're gonna go to customize, obviously. Um, it's only designed to work with the with the uh, shortest cab option, the standard cab. Um, if you select these other cabs, you will not have the chassis option here. So select the shortest cab, which is how they would the sh they would use they use the shortest cabs possible when they make these flatbed configurations in real life. So um, so yeah, and then you go to chassis obviously and select flatbed. Um, it's pretty straightforward. Back here, this node is for all your cargos. These are all the default 28 foot SCS cargos. Um, so yeah, I've only have it configured to use a uh, single exhaust. Um, you can obviously select all your different pipes and stuff like that. Um, it's only set up to use these quarter fenders. Uh, you can swap the mud flaps and such back here. Um, I haven't bothered to go, to go and remove the taillights under there. The original taillights. And the one other thing you want to set up is the airlines. So you want to just select Pindle and that'll put the, your airline connections back here where they belong. Um, so yeah, the, the flatbed on the truck is pretty straightforward. And of course it, it changes colors with the base color of the, of the truck. So whatever you select, it changes color. So you want to change your um, you'll want to save it as a preset and then set your trailer to that as well so they match if that's what you're going for. Um, anyway, so we'll go back and I'll go over the trailer real quick. So you can ignore a lot of these other ones if you don't have my other mod, my 3XX truck and trailer mod installed. The only one you should see is two axle flatbed, and it's just the dolly here. And you go to customize, and then you'll hit, uh, you go to chain type and select pup, and then it will select this uh, this flatbed here. Um, this is from another mod I have installed. You shouldn't see shouldn't see that. I need to go through my mod and actually double check and make sure it's, I, I'm not accidentally including this bumper that shouldn't be in there. Um, oh, I've included long, long flaps that go there. So I think they look better. Put flaps there and you can put your boxes here if you want them. So this is basically a, a stock SCS dolly and trailer. Um, the only thing I did, I changed the, the layout where the, the airlines come out on the dolly and I reduced the height of the frame rails in this direction on the trailer because I think the SCS makes them way too tall. It looks all wonky, so I got that fixed up. But anyway, so that's all that goes into selecting, configuring the truck and the trailer.